do you have a jetted tub like the one here? If you do, you may not know how to properly clean it. A lot of people don't. We inspect a lot of houses with these and we can tell that a lot of times they haven't been used in a pretty long time. And we know that that's probably because the homeowner has been grossed out by the black gunk that's come out of the jets. Uh, they're trying to have a good experience mimicking a hot tub and instead they get grossed out. Um, so I'm gonna take a minute here and go over with you how exactly you clean these. So unlike a hot tub that has chlorine or disinfectants in it, um, you're just relying on your water supply, the residential supply uh, with the tubs. You have to manually clean it every so often yourself. Um, so first of all, uh, one thing you need to keep in mind is that your jetted tub should have what are called air induction valves. And unless your manufacturer of the tub tells you otherwise, you normally want to close those off by turning them fully clockwise. That'll shut them off because we want the water and um, the disinfectant I'm going to be telling you about to circulate through the, just the plumbing of the tub. So uh, unless your manufacturer has told you not to do that, you're going to do that. That's step one. Next thing you're going to do is fill the tub up with hot water to a couple inches above the highest jets. Uh, a lot of the time the jets are about the same height, but you want to make sure to get it above the highest one. So after you've done that, you're going to pour in about a half cup of bleach, or you could use white vinegar if you want to go with a more eco-friendly option. And then you're going to also pour in about two tablespoons of a low sudsing uh, dishwashing detergent. The reason for that is when you run these jets for a while to clean the tub, you don't want it to overfill with suds, that could be a problem. So uh, after you put all that in, you're gonna start the jets, you're gonna run the tub for about 15 minutes, and if you see at the end of that 15 minutes that you still have some dirt or other grime particles coming out of the jets, just let it run a few minutes longer. After that, you're gonna drain all that water out, and then you're just gonna repeat the exact same steps, but without the white vinegar or the bleach or the detergent the second time. So just water and cold water is fine the second time. It doesn't need to be hot, you're just rinsing the tub. So the second time around, you're gonna run the jets for about 10 minutes, so you don't have to do it quite as long. And again, if you see any grime still coming out, just let it run a few more minutes. Um, so that's it. Uh, step one is just with the disinfectant. Step two is just plain cold water. That'll do a really good job of cleaning out your tub. And you're gonna to wanna to do that periodically. You don't have to do it every time after you've used it, but every several times or so. Uh, and you'll be able to tell once you see that gunk forming when you need to do it. Hopefully this will help you to know how to clean your tub better next time and to have the experience that you wanna have with your jetted tub.